What is up guys? This is actually an important video. I will be reviewing this enclosure I got because it seems that there is no other one. And if you're like me, you, you, you don't want to spend a whole lot of money. You're trying to, you know, get by and you need a bigger enclosure, you know, for whatever you're housing. And you're worried that this won't be the one or whatever. And you just need that one video to just like to show you if that's a cool enclosure because it's a good price. Um, and this is the one. So let's get right into it. So we are going to be reviewing the enclosure that I have is called the 36 inch. So it's a 40 gallon. So it's three feet by 18 by 18. Um, and this is the EcoFlex by New Age Pet. All right. And so as you can already see, really, really getting to me. Uh, see, um, the only gripe I have had so far, and let me hit you with the gripe first before I get into everything that's great about the enclosure, is if you sit down, you see that there is like a four inch lip here, all right? And so what that's going to do for you is lessen your ability to see your animal in a lot of cases. Um, it's mainly not going to be an issue, like for the six, the 36 inch the old style is different from the new style um, the new style is this and same thing with the 4x2x2 two by two, which I will be getting and I'll do a review of that one um, the 4x2x2 four two by two has a massive lip so you can hold substrate and so your glass viewing area is a little tiny bit smaller not a deal breaker not a deal breaker so let's get in me and Ragu will get into let's say three things about this enclosure mainly that make it the best most affordable option option where are you going where are you going anyway the best option for any kind of budget consumer if you need an enclosure that's big enough for your reptile and you just can't find one for that good price so here we go so the number one thing that I always look for in an enclosure is my top. So this top has a wide base and this is the 36 inch. So this is my other 40 gallon 36 inch and it's got square uh, mesh screens and you can fit a whole bunch of stuff. And it's the same thing with this. I have a light here, I have a light here, I could put a light here if I needed to, whatever I wanted to do. Um, the only semi not so good thing is there's no cord holes in the back here and here but there is slots around the side that you can stick them through if you had to so if you have a leopard gecko and you want an under tank heater you can still slip your cords through um, you see i have a mounted to the side of my enclosure and that's another cool thing um i won't put this as number two but the vent holes make it really uh have a good airflow and honestly, my humidity is perfect today. Like, it's right where I want it to be. As you can see, 27. 27 is beautiful. Um, I've been trying to attain that for a minute. So, but yeah, that's number one. Number two, guys, is the fact that this thing is lightweight. It literally weighs nothing. You could pick it up, you could throw it. You could literally, but, it, you know, shake test it's it's good doesn't make a whole lot of noise you know it's really well put together and you put it together and there is plastic screws and stuff but it's not bad and once it's all together it's great it's fantastic i love it she's not in it but she will love it <laughs> um but yeah guys it's 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 really well made and you get to put it together and that's the whole fun of it it is a pvc kind of wood composite board kind of um material so i think it, i think it holds up pretty well i don't think it'll deteriorate at all um and yeah um moving on right on to number three and it's one of my bigger issues like i was just talking about my humidity even with i have coconut fiber and reptile soil which are humid 
substrates, but it's what I chose to use for this enclosure. Uh, the humidity does not get too crazy. I'm able to have a good gradient. I'm able to have like the great humidity and it's all there. And I have no problem with having to manage it. And it seems good. Only bad thing, another bad thing about this is it's PVC. So your suction cups are not going to stick. You can use hooks for things. So you're not completely out, but suction cups are not going to work. We got Ragu trying to slide my body. Um, but yeah, guys, dude, this has been the my my honest review of the new age pet 36 inch enclosure uh really well made there is a lock a little slide lock that's really easy there's no key you don't want none of that big stuff um it's great i have no qualm for it for the animal that's in it i'm sure if it was an uh, animal that was very social very wanted to get you know wanted to look around and Maybe you'd have a problem with not so big of a, of a viewing area, but I mean, come on guys. I mean, this thing, 36 inch, the 40 gallon, was only like 100 some, 120 bucks, I believe. You get, here's what you get, come on. This is me standing right in front of it. I mean, the viewing area is honestly amazing. Uh, I couldn't be more happy. It's not completely open like this, but I mean, look, I mean, you got your substrate barrier and you got a substrate barrier. So what more can you want? Honestly, guys, how are you, you know, you're trying to get something that's cost effective. You're not trying to spend your whole paycheck, but you want to get a nice home for your pet. Try this out. Give it a try. I don't think it's too bad. I am going to be getting another one. So if that tells you anything. I will probably use them and I believe they're stackable and they literally sell stackers for them um, so it's great so they sell them in like 24 by 18s uh, 36 by 18s and then the 4 by 2 by 2s so um, great investment if you're just trying to uh, spend a little bit less money and still have a great enclosure um, like I said guys this is Max this is Ragu uh, Duffy's Dinos, man. Uh, check us out. This is not sponsored at all. It could be. But this is the only New Age pet review. So, hopefully you guys will to take something out of this. From side to side. Honestly, looks beautiful. Hey guys, check, us, check out our other videos. My goo's going crazy on my arms, so I gotta go. <laughs> But I will see you guys in the next one. Catch us in another amazing video. It's been Duffy's Dinos. I'll see you guys later.